Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a question that's on the minds of a lot of people, especially those standing at the crossroads of their future, is college necessary to be successful and make good money in life? Let's talk about it. Whether you're someone considering college or someone who has already been through it, I'd love to hear your thoughts, so drop a comment below. Let's get this conversation started. First, let's talk about my personal experience with college. I entered college having no idea what I wanted to do, simply being told that it was the only way to be successful and make money. I picked a random major, chemistry, because that's what my dad studied. I gave no thought to how much money I'd be making after graduation, if grad school was necessary, or any of that. Nobody warned me about the potential pitfalls back then. For the first two years, college consisted of taking general math, science, language, and social science classes with some random other credits like music and art history mixed in. It was a Big Ten school, so people studied hard and partied hard. I got an education in beer consumption as a bonus. Now, if you pick a degree in sciences, usually you need grad school or some sort of specialization to have a good job. Part of my degree involved a lot of lab work, but there was one problem, I hated it. I couldn't stand mixing chemicals, following boring instructions, and taking detailed notes on my experiments. Was this what I wanted to do for the next eight years of my life? I was on the wrong path. I took a computer science class in high school, so I figured, why not give that a shot? Once I started looking at jobs and internships, I realized that I liked computer science much more. Even weirder, I realized nothing I was learning in school would even help me at these jobs. After that, I switched all my classes to computer science, aside from the required filler classes where I studied art, music, and all this other, useful, stuff for making money. Now, I did terribly in my computer science classes. I was struggling to get A, B or C average for the remainder of college. I simply did not care about these classes after seeing what I actually needed to know to succeed in internships. After I got my first internship at a big company as a software developer, I began to see even more clearly the pointlessness of college. I thought I was bad at computer science courses, but I was fine when it came time to be an employee and get the job done. School almost ruined computer science for me. There was one main difference between school and the real job, you actually have internet access for looking things up throughout the workday. It's not about memeizing everything, it's about knowing how to solve problems. So, that's my story. I did go to college, I did get a degree, and yes, I landed a job right after graduation after trying many different things. On the surface, it looks like a solid path, went to college, got a degree, got a good job, and so far, it's worked out well for me. But let me tell you, the experience wasn't all sunshine and rainbows, and it wasn't completely straightforward. Here's what I valued about my college education, it was a unique experience for me, and to be honest, it helped me grow in many ways. I found out what I didn't like, lab work, and what I liked more, coding and computer work. I would also say the last two years of classes were much more specialized and helpful to my major. And sure, college helped me build a foundation in a lot of other things like problem solving, working under pressure, and collaborating with others. But perhaps the biggest benefit wasn't academic at all, it was the social education. I was an introvert in high school, kind of a stereotypical nerd, often buried in textbooks and studying a lot. The social atmosphere of being surrounded by people my age was great in college. I needed that to develop as a person. I value the connections I made just as much as the material learned, if not more. That's very important in today's world, especially in the age of social media. However, let's talk about some of the things that drove me crazy about college. Number 1, Dumb Courses. I had to take a bunch of general education courses that felt completely irrelevant to what I wanted to do. Why was I sitting in an art history class memizing dates or a music class when I wanted to code and learn more about computer science? Why is it relevant to learn about population problems? Even some of the math and algorithms classes seemed irrelevant, considering I could look things up all day at my actual job. I'd say half of my classes were not relevant and almost a complete waste of time. 
Number 2, Cost. The cost of college is now astronomical. Student loans are real burden, and paying them off can feel like a lifetime sentence. It is simply becoming too expensive to be feasible anymore. What might have been a reasonable career path 15 years ago is now no longer realistic if tuition is $20,000 per year. Industries today, especially tech, are evolving faster than the education system. Many of the computer languages and technologies I learned in college were outdated by the time I graduated. Since the internet became such a powerful tool, the importance of memizing vast amounts of information has diminished, but that isn't fully reflected in the school system. What mattered most on the job was problem solving, not memorization. On top of that, society really pushes the idea that you have to go to college to be successful. I felt like I was on autopilot, just going through the motions because that's what I had been told to do. But nobody ever talked about alternatives, nobody sat me down to discuss the economics of tuition versus salary, or whether there was another way to achieve what I wanted. Now, let's be fair, there are definitely situations where a degree is necessary. If you're pursuing a career in medicine, law, engineering, or any field where specialized knowledge and certification are required, college is a must. These fields are highly regulated, and you need that formal education to get licensed and practice professionally. But not every career path requires a degree. In fact, some of the most successful people in tech, business, and the arts either dropped out of college or skipped it altogether. I've worked with many great engineers who didn't attend college. Places like Google have even dropped their college degree requirement for certain jobs. So, what are the alternatives to a four-year degree? One option is trade schools, where more people are turning to learn specific skills like coding, plumbing, or welding without the burden or cost of a four-year college degree. These schools are often shorter, more focused, and can get you job ready in a fraction of the time and cost. Let's also consider the rise of self-education platforms. With the internet, you can learn almost anything online. Platforms like YouTube, coding boot camps, and online courses have opened up a world of opportunities. A growing number of people are proving that you don't need a degree to succeed, just a strong work ethic and a drive to continuously learn. So, in conclusion, is college necessary to make money in life? The answer isn't black and white, but I'm going to say no, it's not. It can be useful, but it is not necessary. It really depends on what you want to do and how you want to get there. For some, college is the right path and can help build a foundation for the rest of their life. For others, it's not. If you're self-motivated, you might be able to succeed without it. The key is to weigh your options, understand the cost, and choose the path that aligns best with your goals and values. Let me know in the comments, what's your take on this? Do you think college is necessary, or are there better ways to achieve success? And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.